Hello everyone, it's Anna here. Thank you for coming back to my channel. Uh, today I'm making basic granny squares and it's gonna be very simple, step-by-step -step tutorial for beginners, so stay with me. Grab your yarn. I'm having four ply yarn and hook number five. So let's get started. I'm starting from the uh, loop which I am placing the yarn in these two fingers, roll over this finger and the other one this way, then place the hook here in first hole, the second loop, and again first one, and that's how we have the first chain. Now I make six single crochets, three, one, two, three, four, five, and six, and I place my hook in the first chain and make slip stitch. So I just grab the yarn through the one and through the second one. And that's how our first basic loop is ready. Now, at the beginning, I need to make chain of four. One, two, three. Sorry, three, not four. My wrong and make double crochet inside the loop. I'm not placing inside the chain, inside the loop. So grab the yarn, put it through, again, grab the yarn, take through both two first, again, grab the yarn, and the last two. So in this point, we have already one and two double crochets. You make one more, grab the yarn, put it through, and again, the two first and grab again yarn and the two. So we have a one, two, three. Now I need to make chain of three, one, two, three to create the corner. And again, repeat these three steps. So grab the yarn and make double crochet. One, two, and three. All right, and then chain of three again, one, two, and three, and repeat again. So we need to repeat it four times to have a square. One, two, three, and we have a three, 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 and again chain of four, three, one, two, and three, and three double crochets inside. One, two, and three. Okay. And the final corner. So I will make a chain of three. One, two, three. And one, two, three. At the top of chain first, I place slip stitch. Okay just a slip stitch so this is our first round actually ready now i make a chain of three four this time four this time is four one two three and four because we have a longer way to travel to this point and again grab the yarn and make a double crochet inside through this two and through this two and make a three one and second one and one more we have a three all right every time on the corner of the square you will make three double crochets chain of three and three double crochets so basically six double crochets with three chains between them so one two and three and go again to the same place and make it three double crochets. Okay. Now, between those, you just make one single crochet. Oi, my one chain. Oi, 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 one chain. One chain, one chain. Okay. And again, grab the yarn and make three double crochets. Two and three and now chain of three one 
two and three and again three double crochets here two and three and again we are on this part so it's one chain one chain grab the yarn another corner which we make again three double crochets and three and chain one two and three and the same place another three double crochets one two and three and on the straight line one chain one and the last corner it goes another three double crochets three and chain three and another this time in the final uh we will make only two double crochets because this part we made a little bit uh, longer so we were having one two and three it's already our double crochet so i place only two one and two and i slip stitch in the first from the bottom one two and three okay get in so in this way we having one two three one gap and yes that's it okay now we make another round so i will take one two and three single crochets So this way I have a, a already one double crochet inside and how it's here I need to repeat this circle now. So I need three double crochet inside here. So grab the yarn and make a second and third. So we have a three double crochets here. Now how we done before I will make chain one and go to this corner and again place three double crochets here okay i make a chain of three like in each corner one two and three and another three double crochets here so we have a six okay And again, I need to go there. So how we done it before, I have a chain one and three double crochets repeated this part here. So take you one, two, and three and now i need to chain one again and three oopsie three double crochets in the corner one two and three oi 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 no good again three and chain of three and again three one two and one more three double crochets here and again going for chain one because we need to make three here so chain one and three double crochets in the middle in the middle one two and three and then chain one and we're going for another corner again one two and three and chain of three and three another double crochets 
one, two, and three. Okay, that is good. And then we need to go there. So one and three inside. One, two, and three. And again, chain one and three on the corner. This is the last corner. One, two, and three. And chain three. And again, one, two, and three. And the final is chain one and slip stitch at the top of the first chain. So that's what we have for now. And um, yeah, that's look good. And now to make it more interesting, I'm thinking to change the yarn color and make one more round. So uh, I just cut this yarn here. I will deal with it later on. This one can be here, it doesn't bother me. Okay, so I will take a white yarn and I will probably remove the last Teach because I'm gonna put the, my white inside. So I will go back again here and just instead of pink, grab the white one and make slip stitch, pull it through. Okay, we are in. All right, so from here, I am making, I need to get there first. So I will make chain of three, one, two, and three, four, actually. Chain of four. And I go inside here with three, I'm repeating this part. So I need to make three single crochets inside. One, two, double crochets. Why well, I'm always keep saying single crochet. I am making toys. And when I make a toys, I'm using always single crochet. So I'm just not thinking now and saying always single crochet. This is double crochet. Sorry for that. Okay. And at the top of this part, we're making chain of one. And then we go into the, our first corner when I'm gonna place three single crochets and gap and another three single crochets. So we will have a six single crochets. So it's three now and then one, two, three chain and another three single double, 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 double crochets, three double crochets. <laughs> one, Two and three. All right, corner is ready. Look cute. Chain one, and again we're repeating this part. So inside goes three double crochets. I said a double. I'm improving. Yes, one, two, and three. And again, chain one, we make another three here, one, okay. Two and three. Then we go to corner, chain one and three double crochets here, one, two and three and chain three and another three double crochets inside the same place one two and three 
one two and three and one single crochet and we go inside there repeating this and here we'll repeat this one okay so we go here and make it three double crochets okay <laughs> one two and three and again chain one and again three one oopsie two and three and another one chain and three double crochets in this corner one two and three chain of three and again three double crochets in the same place two and three and chain one and one two and three okay open quick we, we, we do not go anywhere one two three and chain one and another three one two and three and chain one and another the final one one two three and chain of three and the last three in this corner one two and three so what left what left one so okay so chain one when we finishing it chain one and i need to place three here but because we have already one so i'm only placing two did i make chain one i think i did okay so let's go here make one two oopsie that's not a good one okay it's losing up so what i can do i can just tie these parts because it's coming out okay and we have a one two and this is three so that's why we make the four because we one two three and in the third we make a slip stitch and that it is the basic basic the simple granny square i think it's super super cute you can step up the game and add some extras different colors and the other decorations so you can build with this lots of different things like clothes dresses um, pillow covers anything you like who watches my channel they already know then i like to be doing experimenting and they not always coming out how i want it all right but i'm keep trying so if you feel like step up the game and put this one on another level let's try we'll see what's gonna happen at the end so now i will make a chain of three one two and three and i place in each stitch three double crochets all around so let's go with it this is two and one more is three and again in the next stitch okay i will put one two three you know sometimes my can come out at the end of it something like frankenstein <laughs> from my experimenting okay another one 
two and three and another one one two and three and the next three one two and three so make all your square around the same way oh you stuck make all around three uh, double crochet in each stitch and i will be back we will see what we have done what happened how i reach my first corner here I realize then it's nearly here impossible to to place in the corner uh, three uh, uh, double crochets in each stitch. So what I done here, I place twelve double crochets, but inside this hole, not in the stitches. So let's do this. It's gonna be one, two three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and 12 so that's how i made a corner and now keep going the straight again three 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 just keep repeating trees so one two and three And again, one, two, and three in the same. So, um, yeah, how you can see it's coming out quite cute and different than the boring square. All right, so this is the final product of my experimenting. Uh, it looks quite cute actually. I am wondering what do you think about it and uh, yeah, give me the comments down below so I would like to know how did it go for you and if you like it. Um, yeah, so uh, I will be experimenting more and more and more. I will be doing some new of my ideas, making some new designs. If you like it, subscribe my channel so you can always watch on crochet with me. Uh, yarn and the hook and the product size which I'm using uh, they are always in my description so if you would like to know which yarn I'm using just just have a look down there and thank you for watching um, yeah uh, yes one more thing I just was thinking then this thing we might use if we make big size of it like big size so you can make really pillow of it and this would be cute if you have this kind of around or make a repeated a few squares like that and connect them with this part together so the pillow will be like having these squares around but with this um, this thing around so again thank you for watching and see you soon bye